when we were asked to host Ed Snowden, it was obviously a tremendous honor for us. Uh, last week, Wired called him uh, the most influential man on Twitter. He was nominated for a Nobel Prize. Uh, Time Magazine called him the runner-up uh, for Person of the Year right after the Pope. But today, we have something really, truly special. Um, because this morning, we actually got some historic news that we're very happy about. Um, we received information from Snowden's team that he has received a presidential pardon. When Ed found this out last week, he decided to make this bipartisan event his first public appearance in the United States. So back on U.S. soil for the first time, Mr. Ed Snowden. I think there's one question that's uh, foremost on people's minds in the United States. How on earth, Ed, do you get rid of those Adobe Reader security update messages that are constantly <laughs> popping up? Uh, uh, I suppose you could go to settings and preferences. <laughs> uh, can you guys turn that thing off? <laughs> Is this a bad time? Yeah, we're well, just so uh, oh, wait. something here. Yeah. Hey, how you doing, man? I'm doing well. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Can you hear me? Sorry, everyone. Um, that is Edward Snowden, and uh, <laughs> he's still in Russia. I think. But what we wanted to have here was just a moment where we could see what it would be like when he got that pardon. So, I guess the first question might be, why aren't you here? <laughs> <laughs> 